Hello, welcome to Lab Fishing Video Channel. What with video about? Wild king crab are harvested in giant pots made of steel and mush that are dropped to the ocean floor. In Alaska, king crab seasons normally open in the fall and run through the early winter months, usually between October and January. The harvest of king crab in Alaska is sustainably managed to preserve wild king crab stocks. You may have even seen the Discovery TV show Deadliest Catch which depicts the harvest of the highly prized king crab, often in foul weather, by Maverick Cruz in search of a huge payday. Alaskan king crab fishing is carried out during the fall in the waters off the coast of Alaska and the Aleutian Islands. The commercial catch is shipped worldwide. Large numbers of king crab are also caught in Russian and international waters. Commercial fishing boats are between 12 and 75 meters in length, are equipped with hydraulic systems to lift the catch, and are able to withstand the freezing weather of the Bering Sea. Each fishing boat sets its own sailing schedule during the crabbing season, often staying out for days or weeks at a time. Fishermen use a box-shaped trap called a pot, which consists of a steel frame covered with a nylon mesh. Each pot weighs 600 to 800 pounds, 270 to 360 kilograms, and a ship may carry 150 to 300 pots. Fish, usually herring or codfish, are placed inside as bait, and then the pot is sunk to the sea floor where the king crabs reside. The pots are dropped in a straight line, known as a string, for easier retrieval. Red and blue king crab can be found between the intertidal zone and a depth of 100 fathoms, 600 feet, 180 meters. Golden king crab live in depths between 100 and 400 fathoms, 180 to 720 meters, 600 to 2,400 feet. The location of the pot is marked on the surface by a buoy, which is later used for retrieval. After allowing the pots to rest on the seafloor, the pots are hauled back to the surface using a hydraulic winch with a pulley on the end called a block. is then brought on board the boat and the crew sorts the catch. Any crabs not meeting the regulation requirements for size and sex are thrown back. The crabs are stored within a holding tank until the boat reaches shore, where they are sold. In 
1980, at the peak of the king crab industry, Alaskan fisheries produced up to 200 million pounds, 91 million kilograms, of crab. However, by 1983, the total size of the catch had dropped by up to 90% in some places. Several theories for the precipitous drop in the crab population have been proposed, including overfishing, warmer waters, and increased fish predation. As a result, the current season is very short, only 24 million pounds, 11 million kilograms, of red king crab were landed. The 2022 to 2023 crabbing season for Bering Sea Snow Crab and Bristol Bay Red King Crab were both cancelled in October by Alaska's Department of Fish and Game. It's the first time that the U.S. snow crab season has been cancelled. Bristol Bay Red King Crab also saw its 2021 to 2022 season cancelled. Pas fort, pas fort la prise. Comme vous voyez, c'est tirette le plus rapide sur la sur la tirette. Comment vous dites?